Air Burst Grenade HTE-309 is used on all 40mm automatic NATO grenade launchers with ABM system. The grenade was developed by Rheinmetall jointly with Singapore Technologies Kinetics. The setback generator was developed by RWM ZOG AG. The grenade has 330 tungsten balls located under the fairing. To ensure an air blast, an electronic timer module is located in the grenade. The electronic timer module together with the safe and arm system ensures safety and handling and arming of the fuse when fired. The safe and arm system is a gear mechanism with a detonator offset relative to the central axis. This mechanism is fixed using centrifugal and setback pins. Electronic timer module consists of a setback generator, receiving coil and an electronic unit that controls air and contact detonation. When a shot is fired, several things happen at once. First, the magnet of the setback generator shifts under the influence of an axial overload, creating changes in the magnetic field of the charging coil. This is how energy appears to power the electronic timer module. Centrifugal and setback pins unlock the main gear, which, due to the shifted center of its gravity, begins to rotate in the desired direction until the detonator stands opposite the firing hole. The speed of rotation of the main gear is limited by other elements of the gear mechanism. Trigger coil detects the passage of a grenade and gives a signal to the programming module to generate and issue a command to the grenade. The programming coil transmits to the grenade the time after which the grenade should explode, and also disables the contact action on the obstacle, if necessary. Due to a number of technical decisions taken, full arming of the fuse occurs at about 40 meters. The grenade hits targets with tungsten balls. Moreover, in modern conditions, a grenade can be used to destroy unmanned aerial vehicles. When the program time has elapsed, the electronic timer module initiates the firing chain. Thank you for watching my video.